Today we're taking a very quick look at the new Osmo Action 4, DJI's newest action camera. Building heavily upon last year's Action 3, the Action 4 keeps all the things that the 3 did right while improving in key areas such as image quality and durability. Starting with that form factor and body, the only major thing you'll likely notice that differs from the Action 3 is that this says Action 4 instead. But if you look closely around the lens, you'll also see that the Action 4 has a sensor size of 1 over 1.3 inches. This is a substantial upgrade over the previous camera's 1 over 1.7 inch sensor, meaning you'll be getting better overall image quality and, most importantly, better low light performance, which is usually the Achilles heel of small action cameras. Going hand in hand with this improved sensor is improved color processing, as the Osmo Action 4 also features 10-bit color with support for D-Log-M at launch, whereas the Osmo Action 3 launched with 8-bit color prior to a firmware update. One area where the Action 3 really impressed was with its durability, where it was one of the most water and freeze-proof action cameras you could buy. The Action 4 maintains that same impressive freeze resistance with an operating temperature down to negative 20 degrees Celsius, or negative 4 degrees Fahrenheit, but goes even further with its waterproofing, allowing you to submerge the camera up to 18 meters, or 60 feet, with no protective frame, up from 16 meters in the Action 3. As for the primary video specs, the Action 4 keeps the same resolutions and frame rate you would expect from a modern action camera, including 4K slow motion at up to 120 frames per second, while also providing that already mentioned boost to overall image quality. It'll reach 4K at up to 120 frames per second in the widescreen mode, and can shoot 4K 60 when using the ultra-wide 155 degree field of view. That same impressive rock steady image stabilization and horizon steady tilt correction are here as well, and when it comes to battery life, the Action 4 shares the same impressive 160 60 minutes of battery life and fast charging support. It also features a triple mic array that supports omnidirectional recording and genuinely impressive audio quality. So this is a quick test of the onboard microphones you get on the Osmo Action 4. Now the Osmo Action 3 had really good microphones on board actually, and this one has a very similar array. It's a three capsule mic array, and it's really good at reducing uh, background noise as well. So I'm currently on a very busy New York City street, and it seems to be doing a pretty good job, but let me know what you guys think. Finally, it also brings the same excellent full-color, dual-touchscreen support, allowing you to quickly change your settings and frame your shot no matter how the camera is oriented. The Osmo Action 4 is also launching with a ton of accessories for biking, hiking, swimming, and other outdoor activities. It also comes in this adventure combo kit, which includes an extension rod, protective frames, adapter mounts, and a battery charging case that includes three batteries. One really cool new accessory is the GPS Bluetooth remote control, which we didn't get a chance to test out, but will allow you to remotely control the start of recording and adds GPS data that you can integrate into your video in the DJI MIMO app. And that's a very quick look at the new Osmo Action 4. If you're looking for an action camera that marries great image quality with some of the best-in-class durability, then DJI's Osmo Action 4 is definitely worth a serious look. But what do you think of the Action 4? Let us know in the comments below. Seriously, we do read them. I'm Nick with B&H. Stay creative.